We are Luke and Heather Bell, and we have eight children. Seven of them are adopted, and we are a family of 10, and this is Live in Large. So I'm gonna show you how to make my famous chocolate chip cookies. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to, um, I'm a little tired today because our power went out last night, and we all fall asleep to a fan, and the fan wasn't going, so we're wide awake. So, um, so the first thing we're gonna do is, um, I'm actually tripling my batch, so I'm going to give you the ingredients for a single batch and then um, I'm going to actually quadruple mine. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to cream your shortening, your sugars, your butter, um, your eggs and vanilla. So it is, um, so it's two thirds cup of butter. Let me get all my butter in here. Two thirds cup of butter. I probably should have put my butter in ahead of time before I even started this. You grab all my butter out. I always have to quadruple or triple my recipes just because you make the cookies kind of big and my kids like really, really love cookies, especially my Robert. Like he really, really, like on the video I made, really, 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 like he really likes cookies. So I have to make lots. Let me just finish getting this in. Two thirds cup of butter. And then my kids didn't have school today because we kind of got an ice storm and it worked out really well. And then also two thirds cup of shortening. So I'm gonna put that in there. And then it's two eggs. All right. Yeah, you can come when he's done. And then um, it's one teaspoon of vanilla. And then one cup of sugar. And then one cup of packed brown sugar. All right, so I'm gonna mix all this up. I like to keep my station clean when I cook. Just let him cook the pizza and then he will come out with you, okay? All right, I'm gonna mix all this together. Hustle up Josh so you can help. Of course I have my That's a Bowl from Tupperware. Love them, love them, love them. I have a ton of these. I use them a lot during the holidays when I'm making big batches of cookies. Somehow I think I got green sprinkles in my brown sugar because every time I make cookies, I have a couple of green, green sprinkles in there. So like I said earlier, I'm making these cookies for uh, a funeral today. My son uh, Gideon lost a friend on Friday. And there's expected to be, they actually had to move the funeral to a church because they knew they wouldn't have any room at the funeral home and they're not gonna. So I, I called up the pastor's wife and asked if there was something I can do and it's being catered, but I said, well, there's gonna be lots of kids there. Who doesn't like chocolate chip cookies? All right, that looks good. All right. And now I have here is my three cups of flour, a teaspoon of salt, and a teaspoon of baking powder. I put the baking powder and the salt in the flour already and kind of took a whisk and mixed it up. So I'm gonna add this a little bit at a time. Bye, Bye Josh. Thank you for helping. Haley's make is at the barn washing eggs. Um, she's gonna take Josh into work today. So yesterday, <laughs> this poor kid. So yesterday, hold on a second. So yesterday, um, we took Josh into work, and we're going to a Red Wings game this week. Um, we're pretty excited about it, so we leave tomorrow, and um, we get to watch them in a private practice, and so I'm going to be vlogging that. It'll be cool to watch. So fun. So anyway, um, around, he worked from 1230 to 5. Boy, my hands are tired. Um, he worked from 1230 to 5, 
and I get a message from the lady who schedules and she's like, I just want to let you know that Josh didn't work today. <laughs> but because he was here, we went ahead and worked him. And so he does work tomorrow. And I said, okay, well, do you want him tomorrow? She's like, yeah, he does need to work. And I'm glad because I want him to get as many hours as he can. But I was like, ah, so Josh, he comes home. He's like, so I wasn't supposed to work today, but they found something for me to do. And uh, so funny. So just make sure, I do have us, every keeps asking, this girl needs a kitchen, KitchenAid stand mixer, which I do have one. But um, it's hard because I have to do such big batches of cookies. It's hard to actually get all of it in there. I need to get one of those big ones. All right, let's put the last of it in here. So yeah, he ended up working an extra day. <laughs> he says, mom, I made lots of money. I'm like, that's good. So let's get this all mixed. And then I'm gonna add the chocolate chips here. Yeah, this morning was kind of a rough morning. I, uh, I don't know. Now that I see my picture, like with my neck, I'm gonna just try and keep my neck really high because of the wrinkles. Oh my goodness, crazy. So my husband has the boys and they're gonna go fill the fuel tank um, because we had to start our generator because when the power goes out, the lights don't go on for the chickens, the um, the doors don't open up for them to lay the eggs. And the last time this happened and we didn't catch it, we lost a lot of chickens. I just cried and cried. It was just a nightmare. It was so hot in there. I think we were at church when it happened. I, I don't remember, but it was just not good. All right, almost done here. So Luke got up this morning and got a generator going so the lights would come on for the chickens and they could start laying eggs and get that airflow going because they're not outside right now because it's so cold. Um, ooh, it's so cold outside and with the snow. So next week's supposed to be in the 40s. And so we're gonna be getting our chickens outside, get the fences going. Let me just clean the mess up here. And get my chickies outside. I love my chickens. All right, let me just clean up my mess here. I washed my hands. Um, just because I'm gonna mix it with my hands, it's a lot easier. So I like to add different kinds of chips to my cookies. Um, I love to add mini chips because I just feel like it brings like a different texture to the cookies. So I'm going to be doing semi-sweet regular um, mini chocolate chips and I'm going to add chocolate chunks today because I want to make them super special for the kids. So um, you could put about a cup of each, a cup and a half of each depending like if you do one batch of cookies, you're probably gonna wanna add maybe a quarter to a half a cup of each one. So now my regular semi-sweet. You can do milk chocolate chips too. Um, I, I tend to use the semi-sweet because I think when they cook, they don't melt as fast and they're not kind of, I don't like things on my hands. So they're not, I'm actually gonna use the whole bag of the chunk. They're not as, um, I know they just get real, they melt really easy, so they're just kind of gooey and I don't know. That's just me, that's just me. And I do keep my chocolate chips in the freezer because I do feel like they stay fresher longer. And in those summer when it gets hot and they don't melt. All right, put that to the side. And I turn my oven on. So the power went out, so my oven has to be reset, okay. I just washed my hands so I can mix the cookies with my hands. This is like, this recipe is just like a no fail. I'm getting an arm workout today, don't have to work out. I just, I, honestly, people ask me if I make regular size stuff, I don't know how. Like, it's really weird. I, I've never made just a regular recipe of one batch. I mean, I haven't done it in years. I mean, even before we adopted our children, we had lots of foster kids coming into our home. So we always had to, that looks pretty good. So we always had to cook big, you know. Let me get my little piggies washed. I got that oven preheating. Uh, I do around 320 to 325. I don't want to, like I know sometimes the recipe calls for 375. It's my mom's recipe that she finally shared with me. Um, but I don't like to cook them that hot because I feel like they get brown super fast and the insides don't get cooked. 
and my mom always used a spoon. I used to use a, a, a cookie dropper, but she says use a spoon because then you can make them big and then they just kind of look natural. You know, they don't, you don't have to roll them in a ball and I actually got to call my mom today. She's called me a couple times, but it's just been just kind of hectic with what's going on with Gideon. I've been uh, trying to spend lots of time with him. So I've been taking him and his friends to lunch and when he walks in the door, I'm like, hey, let's go eat. And uh, he's been sleeping a lot too. But I mean, he's a boy and boys sleep. So you want him kind of big. You don't want him rinky dink. That's why I like the spoon. I used to be one that made sure they were beautiful. My mom's like, why are you doing that? Just use a spoon. I'm like, oh, okay. And so now I get it. Now I understand why. So it's not just enough to have a recipe. I gotta make sure I'm doing things right. You know, technically, technical wise. It's technical, technically, I don't know. So yeah, I've already had an emotional morning sharing that video with you guys. Um, I thought about putting it on my Instagram, maybe pieces of it to just share with people, but I don't know, I don't really wanna I don't know. I just, uh, I'm trying to be really respectful of the family, you know, and, uh, even though it was announced what happened, I just don't really feel like it's my place to share it and to talk about it. And it's just, it doesn't matter. It's just enough that he just felt like he didn't want to be here anymore. So I'm going to continue to do this. Um, put them on my pans. It's going to take a little bit just because I have to make so many cookies so once these are all done, um, I'll get back on here and show you how they look. So it's going really well with the cookies. I got a couple batches. My son Gideon stole my cookies. I told him to please stay out of it, taking the cookie dough. So I got a couple in. They look really good. Everybody's starting to come back. We leave in a little bit for the funeral. So I put my oven on convection and that's kind of why I lower the temperature is so um, it doesn't burn the cookies. I'm still kind of learning how to, how to use my stove because there's so many different, um, like it has like nine buttons. And so it's kind of hard to figure out like what to do like when you make cookies, what's the best thing? So I just keep an eye on them. Are you I'm not TikToking, I'm vlogging. You say that every time. I'm not TikToking, I'm vlogging. It's still gonna go on TikTok. No, it's not. YouTube. See how much he loves me? You're mean to me. You liar. They just saw it. They should have seen how you were acting towards me about five minutes ago. Oh, because you were trying to steal cookies and I wanted them for the funeral? That makes me a bad mom? You almost killed me. That makes you bad. I did not. That's horrible to say. That's wrong. Wrong. Wrong, wrong. That is such a lie. Oh my goodness, you're horrible. Ouch. That's really hot. All right, so I'm going to get some more on this pan. So I... I got four pans so I can just keep them going. When two come out, I can put two in. So, Gideon! You know, I think Robert took a shower once and used your stuff too because he smelt like you. Unless everybody's using the same stuff. So Gideon, for some reason, started using Haley's bathroom and he uses all her products. Gideon, do not use any of my stuff. Yes, you have it. In the bathroom as we speak. Do not use it. Don't break the door down. Gideon, don't break the door down. Gideon, just don't use our stuff. Do not, Gideon. I'm stealing my money. And buying my own stuff. How are you gonna steal his money? Is his wallet? Is his wallet? Oh! So David, um, we think he has a corneal ulcer. So he's been taking drops since what? 
Saturday. He has like a little white bump on his eye. Show him the white bump in your eye. Don't be stupid. Nobody needs to know about my eye People love us. It's not a problem. You're getting it fixed. It's not a problem. Hey, you want to call Sarah? I don't know what Steve Harvey is. Grab, the, grab him. I will cut your hair. Let me finish these cookies. Love and you. I will cut your hair. You don't cut my hair as good. I do cut it very good. I do cut it very good. There's another green sprinkle. I don't know how these green sprinkles ended up in my cookies, but they did. Um, I don't think you do. Plus, Sarah gets mad when anybody else cuts my hair. She does not. <laughs> That's what you think. I was out of college. I had the... Yeah, she's like, not going to care if your mom cuts your hair. I don't know. I've never met this dude before. I think he's like, Dave, but the, can you let this... Uh, can we cut your hair? So I'm like, shoot. Is he found out? He got mad at me. No. I have been the one cutting your hair. I do not know what you're talking about. Well, maybe I cut my hair like the last two years. I have too. Oh, ah, because I was down at college and then. You haven't been to college in over a year. Yeah, and then Haley cut my hair. Well, okay. Haley's right there. Have her cut your hair. No, well, Haley sucks. Stop it. Oh, I'm kidding. This is stop. I know you're kidding, but stop it. It's just not as good as Sarah's. I can cut your hair, dude. Uh, maybe that might be better than that. Okay. What time you got to work? 12. Okay, well, you better hustle. Go get in the shower or get get the scissors and stuff. See? I'm almost done with cookies. No, you, you know how to do a fade. I know how to do a fade. I've done it before. Uh, Just grab the clippers. I can take care of it. So I guess Gideon and his friends are going to go get some lunch. They're going to wear their jerseys to the funeral today. David has to work at noon. Josh has to work at 12.30. So Haley's going to run. Yeah, we're just, we're dreading it. We're really, really dreading it. Do you think somebody's going to wear his jersey? Or do you think they'll just have it up there? Do you think they'll retire his jersey? Well, he was number two, and then I think he became number eight for cop football. No, I think no, they... he was number two in football. Even all through high school? Even because he was... Last year he was 2-2. I wonder if they'll retire his jersey. Like five, when he was little. In basketball. So they're gonna wear their jerseys and I then. Like, um, I don't know they're gonna do. Hey, put, don't put it by the cookies, put it over here. All right, I'm gonna cut David's hair. I'll be back. All right, so I just got David's hair cut. Now I'm gonna finish my cookies. Haley's just hanging out. Much. And oh, she is. She just got done washing it. Well, yeah. a little bit ago. No. She says she just got done, but I think it was a little bit ago. I don't understand the mama jokes because I'm the mama. Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. Yeah, no. He says it's dumb too. <laughs> it's really dumb. You're so dumb. He does not say that. <laughs> he, he doesn't even talk like that. He tells me I don't like anything. Well, you better get used to that. Where's Dad? He's coming. He's coming too? Why are you crying? You guys get the fuel put back in the... Yeah. I love the fuel punch kind of stuff. Look at him. Brush your teeth? Maybe that's why she doesn't smell good. I did brush my teeth and it's my hair stuff. Well, Haley's hair stuff smells bad too. It smells like stale butter. It smells better than butter. I don't know. Stale butter and butt crack <laughs> might be the same. I, I'm literally in the bathroom. He comes up after he sees me go to the bathroom. He's in the shower. As he stood there for five minutes. Well, he does have to take a shower. You can go in your room and do things. <laughs> You don't have to be in there. Suck that. Well, all my stuff's in there. And it goes, I know, but you can. Downstairs. No, it's Haley's bathroom. Well, it's Gideon and Haley's yeah. bathroom. Yeah, it's not Gideon and Haley's bathroom. And which, she doesn't like it. Which it was never Gideon and Haley's bathroom. Actually, it was always just you. Yeah, until Gideon found my stuff, and now he won't stop using it. That's because he got his little, well, his little caddy, and he doesn't. Uh, well, I buy good stuff. Yes, well, you do buy good is stuff. Garbage. Good thing I only got it for 59 cents. 
All right, so I got my latch batch, latch, latch batch. Last batch. There we go, my last batch. Okay, I got two in. I'm actually gonna put this one in the bottom. There we go. You wanna find a card for Hannah? Yeah, you spelled your name wrong. Yeah, you did. I copied it right off of Erica's email. It's H A N N A H. We'll put an H on there. Well, you still spelled it wrong. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh! Okay. So they're back in front. Yeah, you need to go get ready. And listen, tie, clean shirt. Um, this was in my bedroom, the there's some show. pants I washed. So you have clean pants in my bedroom. Oh, sweet. Put a new tie hey, right. on. Is your, oh, you I already got a tie. Did you, it's in my room. Did Mom. you straighten your hair? Mom. Yeah. What? Why do you got a tie? It's at my work. No, no, you have what to put new that? ties on. New that ties. Work? I just that goes in the laundry. Yeah, yeah, work. You, you would have never have done this. You want to say hi to everybody? Oh. Oh. Hey, uh, clean shirt, clean pants, and a tie. I is it time for breakfast? No, I don't need have a cookie. Please tell him he needs a tie. Yeah, I have one at work. Just Sitting put one locker. in your pocket just You in have case. a pile of them. Put the frog one on. That's really oh. cute. Josh and bring home your ties. ties every day so we know which one. Yeah, you want to do new ties. You don't want to do the same ties over and over. Because you want to look fresh and clean. Brush your teeth, brush your hair. Did you get your medicine this morning? Yeah, Dad. He's not going to be able to brush your teeth and brush your hair. Your brush your teeth, brush your hair. I washed a pair of your pants. They're in my bedroom in that. Those look great. Do they? Okay. Yeah. And the, um, that hamper, I did some of your laundry, so you have pants in there. <sighs> All right, I have one more due. Oh, so I just told you I washed a pair of your pants. They're in my hamper. Get a clean white shirt on and a new tie. I found a big oh, barrel. Tie, and so I just put it in Poppy Stone. Looks it like it's snowing. Josh, well, can you just listen, please? Five hundred dollars in gas in that tank. Just listen, please. It normally costs me two or three hundred to fill it. it. Cost me five. They're listening to him, not listen to me. Well, it's not live, but he's still going. His ties at work. He did leave his tie at work. I know, his but he has a lot of spot. ties. He can change his ties up because he got so many ties from people. All right, let me get the last of these out of here. I'm going to make eggs and toast. Do I have bread? Then I'll just make eggs. No, I'm just asking. You know what we could do is put eggs on cookies and see how that tastes. Here's your bread. That's gross. You guys. People are seeing real life. You can't hide it for so long. No, that's true. I guess we're like every other normal family. When people say, people say, oh, that's a nice truck you got. I just say, yeah, my wife does TikTok. It's crazy good money. Yeah, yeah. That is such a lie. I wish I made that much money. She makes the big bucks. <sighs> Enough. I wake up to know. I wish I made the big bucks. We'd quit our business. Take dad to Florida. When you were laying in your bed perfectly fine, able to walk, and you made the bed. She did wake us up to let us know. Mm -hmm. Is he? Yes, I did. She All right. At me. Is he so Cookies are done. No. Family's awake. Haley hey, doesn't get enough, this. Enough, you guys. Really enough, enough, hey, enough, Izzy. enough. Haley thinks I didn't get okay. out Okay. Enough. We're trying to talk to you. Okay, go ahead. No, here. Here, talk. Go ahead. Oh. Uh, we're not fake. This is our life. Okay, go ahead. Be real. We're not fake. This is our life. We're not fake. Okay. Cookies are done. I guess everybody's kind of a little fake, but. Yep. <laughs> All right. Cookies are done to take to the funeral. Say hi, Noah. All right. There we go. I hope it's a blessing to people. Okay. Okay, there's cold pizza. That's three batches. That's three batches. I made them kind of big. Oh, really nice. Yeah.
Okay, cookies are done. We're gonna have some breakfast and get ready for our day. Just be praying for our community and the kids. In my closet.